Hey, welcome to MechaJiki. In today's tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to manage your render garden processes just through your Finder window. So here we are inside of our project that we just rendered out in our previous tutorial. And what I'm going to do is actually resubmit it to Render Garden. So we're going to go ahead and actually go to Render Queue, check this box. Let's just change the name over here to from RG20 multi nodes to manage. Let's save. And currently we're actually going to bring this back down to 10. And for priority, we'll keep it at a 1. Post render actions, we'll actually turn that off for the sake of this tutorial. And we're going to go ahead and plant our seeds. So now that we've planted the seeds, let's open up our seed bank and let's go through everything. So now that I've planted these, you can see that currently we have some of the seeds getting picked up and they're going to start rendering any second now after they get loaded. But Say if I want to kill any of these, if I just want them to stop. What you could easily do, and say for like this one, for seed one, for Mechajiki, load it up. And I could show you that as long as you actually go to the beginning and just put an X or change the name, you can actually kill that render. So you can see here, it says render killed, and it immediately picks up the next job. So in order to requeue this file or this render, what you could be able to do is just go in here change the beginning from rendering or X rendering to ready and then another machine will pick it up. So say if you need to kill your render entirely like you're like oh I messed up I didn't want to submit this what you could do is actually go up here to the main root or even this file here and just do right click move to trash and once you do that immediately all of your render garden processes on this machine as well as on your render node immediately get killed. And what happens is it doesn't actually kill the gardener window itself. It'll just continue searching. It just kills that render. And if you need to bring that back, you could always go back to, say, your trash can. You could say, put back. But you need to set up all your seeds here to change from rendering to ready. So we could just do a mass rename and go rendering to ready and rename. And what will happen is your gardeners will actually automatically pick them back up. And it will notice that you already have output files there, but it's going to overwrite them already. Now, say if you want to actually kill the gardener window itself, what you'll need to do is actually go into each individual window and do a control C, not a command C, but a control C. And what they'll do is they'll actually exit gardener. So you just need to do that individually to each one. That way it kills the entire gardener process. And then you'll also need to do it on your remote machines as well. So control C, control C, control C. And then you can reactivate a gardener process by double clicking on render garden gardener. Or if you're on your submit machine, selecting launch more gardeners within the script UI. And that is how you can be able to manage your render garden process just within the finder window.